So it's uh, Thanksgiving 2014 and you can see it's pretty snowy out and I'm dressed like uh, I'm running because I got back from a run and we're going to pick up our friend uh, who's coming to our family Thanksgiving party uh, and I didn't have time to change so I haven't even showered yet, I'm all smelly and stuff and I'm going into Wegmans just like this because I don't give a fuck and uh, I'm going to pick up some stuff for my salad and uh, just some other stuff that my mom needs. And uh, I actually haven't eaten anything today uh, other than when I was uh, taste testing my hummus that I made for the salad. And so it's gonna be a really big salad. Um, although I don't have my giant wooden salad bowl, I forgot it at school. So I'm gonna have to settle for a dinky bowl. And uh, I will show you guys my salad and I'll let you guys know what the recipe is and stuff. And uh, I will see you at uh, probably the Thanksgiving party. Or maybe I'll, no, I'll see you guys at Wegmans. I'll show you guys stuff at Wegmans. I'll see you then. So this, the, this is the coolest part of Wegmans. We got any, uh, any of the uh, cool exotic fruit. We got uh, sugar cane sticks, aloe vera, horn melon. I tried this before, like years ago with my friend. It, it honestly smells, it smells like grass. And you got dragon fruit. Obviously it's gonna be super expensive. Um, I tried these before. It's sort of like a squash type thing. I don't know exactly, but uh, oh, there's high chia percentage right there. But this is the whole huge. This is the biggest Wegmans that I've ever been to. It's it's huge. So I'm just getting, I think, uh, spinach, grape tomatoes, uh, barbecue sauce, and black beans for my mom, and I think that's it. But uh, I'm pretty excited for this. I actually forgot my big giant wooden bowl uh, to go to Thanksgiving. I left that at school, so I'm probably just gonna split up my giant salad into two other giant bowls. Cause it's gonna be a huge salad because I, um, I'm, very, I'm gonna be very hungry because I haven't eaten anything yet today. Kind of saving room, and I kind of just wasn't hungry earlier just because I, I ate so much um, chili last night. I made some vegan chili for my family, and I ate a lot of it. So I w it was still holding me over until earlier today. So um, this is the stuff I'm. Gonna be uh, probably the spring mix, spinach. Um, you'll get the. It's not spring mix and spinach. This one, spinach and spring mix. How much is it? Uh, Eleven ounces. Fuck it. We need sixteen ounces. Spring mix it is. All right. Look at these. Just look at all these tomatoes. You got beef steak. You got these cool yellow things. Cherry tomatoes. Grape tomatoes. This is. It's like tomato heaven. So, uh, oh, I'm probably going to go with, uh, if I can reach them, these ones right here. These, I really like these ones. So, there's the tomatoes. All right, so this is what I put in the old salad. There's a fork in there somewhere. Uh, there's the spring mix. I used the whole, the whole one pound thing. I uh, got the, the rest, this, this whole thing right here. All, everything's things. So it's one point, pint of the grape tomatoes. I got one can of beans in here, one red pepper, one orange pepper. I found some corn in the fridge. And uh, this, actually this one, yeah, you can probably see it better. Some quinoa, black beans, peppers, tomatoes, and uh, that's the dressing I'm gonna use is the hummus, and that's why I've got the barbecue sauce. Uh, partially so I can put some in here and blend it up real quick. Um, and uh, also just because I love barbecue sauce, and we didn't have any. So um, I'm probably gonna be eating both of these at Thanksgiving. Uh, I may leave this one out just like for a little bit so people can pick at it uh, before they pick their stuff but uh, I'll just be eating what they don't eat and uh, we'll see you guys later. Round one. You're going to eat that whole thing? Mm -hmm. And that one over there. No way. Mm -hmm. oh. My family members are surprised sometimes. Hey, hey Clancy. Alright so I just uh, finished off these two salads. I left this one on the table over here so people can pick at it while they're, uh, uh, you know, filling up their plate. And uh, I just want to show you guys real quick all the vegan options that Thanksgiving actually has. Uh, Tostitos are obviously vegan. 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 These are vegan. They're not the healthiest, but they're also vegan. Um, my aunt also brought this salad. This is also vegan. It's also vegan. My mom brought this. My mom brought this. And it's also vegan. So it's this. And this. So all, all the stuff pretty much other than this and maybe some of the dressings they might be vegan. I don't know. Um, so most of that stuff is vegan. And this stuff is like the meat and stuff over here. So that's obviously not. But I think there's these are like scalloped potatoes. So I mean you can definitely make scalloped potatoes vegan. Um, but there's 
There are a lot of vegan options uh, as far as Thanksgiving goes. I just personally, when I go to family parties, I just bring a salad. That's just what I do. I don't know. It's just it's a habit. I think it's because when I was raw vegan, I would just it was easier to bring a salad than just bring like a mono meal of fruit. Um, I just felt like. Uh, I just, I felt like everyone else was eating sort of like the same thing because they could just pick through my salad instead of saying, hey, do you want a peach with your your whatever else you're eating? Like, I, I felt like a salad was just more applicable. So that's just, I just like a habit now. So, I mean, you can bring whatever you want. I was going to bring a vegan um, pumpkin bread, but I didn't get around to it. So maybe I'll do that for Christmas and maybe I'll show you guys what I'm eating then. But anyway, that's, I don't even know if I'll eat again later because that was really huge. It was like a pound of greens, two pounds of beans, and it was, it was very very heavy salad. Um, so anyway, I I have plans later tonight, and hopefully I'll be able to show you guys them because they're they're gonna be pretty cool plans. So Clancy. Anyway, uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. So we had the brilliant idea of going to Walmart on Black Friday uh, for construction paper and tape. So it's pretty busy right now. It's a lot of people, um, but we're just here for tape and construction paper and uh, I'll show you guys that in a second but um, we're probably about the only people here looking for tape and construction paper on Black Friday. <laughs> so this is what we uh, needed construction paper and tape for because uh, we're, oh we've been watching It's Always Sunny and McGruber and uh, we decorated this place because apparently I've been in a really decorating mood lately. This is the uh, Syracuse University Senior Art Studio. We gave everyone some nice uh, stockings with their names on it, and paper chains, and uh, we made, oh, this person, we made them some uh, Halloween snowflakes. Um, we made normal snowflakes over here. That one, I'm pretty proud of that one. And uh, yeah, so we just decorated a lot, so that's what we did for Thanksgiving, and uh, I actually haven't, I haven't eaten anything since that salad. I'm kind of hungry, but I'm too tired, so I think when I'm going to go home, I'm just going to sleep because I'm not hungry enough to actually care that I'm hungry. I'm just so tired. I just want to go home and I just want to sleep. So uh, that was all I ate today though. So um, again, that's why I said at the family party actually that I, you know, if you are vegan and you want to go to a Thanksgiving party, you don't have to just eat salad like I did, you know? Um, that's just what I like to do. It's just my preference. So, um, you know, if you want to bring like some mashed sweet potatoes, because let's be honest, it tastes better than mashed potatoes anyway. If you want to bring some mashed sweet potatoes or something and just, pig out on that or something like that, then that's great too. So there's tons of different options that you could choose. Um, I just chose that one. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys, uh, maybe you could use that salad recipe. Let me know what you think. But I can't let you guys go without a quick chronometer analysis. So this was my hummus recipe and this was my salad recipe. Uh, so I didn't eat nearly enough calories today just because I ate once and I don't think I've ever done that in my life So eat more than once a day and you'll be sure to get enough calories uh, I definitely got more than enough protein even though I got uh, very few calories for the day I almost got 90 grams and so when people ask you where you get your protein from you can tell them it's from salad uh, So I'm just gonna end it right here So if you guys want you guys can pause the video and see what my actual nutrients were for the day But keep in mind I normally eat much more than this uh, so, you know, hopefully I'll be uploading more um, what I eat vid in a day videos and uh, you guys can see what I actually eat in a normal day. Uh, so anyway, I uh, hope to see you guys in some of those videos and I'll see you later. So my, we uh, we found a, a deer outside. This is this is the biggest deer I've ever seen in my life. You guys, you guys, you guys got to see this deer. Can you send it to me? Yeah. Can you see right Look at that. That's the biggest deer I've ever seen. Oh dear. Oh, can dear. you can't go out, Lisa? No, I sucks my finger in. Yes, the cat can get out. <laughs>